Hello everybody, so today I'm here with Julian and Dylan and we are going to do a little toy review of top two to three toys that we have been enjoying right now for the past the Christmas season. So, go ahead Julian, Dylan. Oh my god, now I got them confused. Um, this one's a fire truck. Uh huh, so describe the fire truck. What does this show the fire truck? Alright, that's the fire truck. This one is by Matchbox. Um, and it's one of the toys I keep, he keeps pulling back and playing with, um, along with the ultimate garage, which he got it all disembobulated right now. <laughs> the other, um, car is, uh, it's a Hot Wheel. Uh-huh. And what do you like about the Hot Wheel? The Hot Wheels are cool. And they got these wheels at back and the back doors raised up. Yeah, so we could see the surfboard and the engine. This is this one came in a set of the Volks. It was a Volkswagen um, set, and this is a minivan. And I know I want to say it's a little Baja style because of the little <coughs> like um, Willy bar <laughs> in the back. Um, and it's also like a surfer kind of um, surfing oh, kind of van. Like if you were to be a surfer, this is one of the bands. I don't know <laughs> that you have because. Got a surfboard. <laughs> All right, another toy that uh, Dylan has been enjoying a lot, and it's a set of two. It is the um, remote control police and ca and chaser car. These two are great. They are, like I said, it's remote control. But one of the things that we aim for this time around was um, being rechargeable, um, because one of the main problems that we always have is batteries. So this baby, we could charge it up, and they'd be ready to go, and he could go ahead and play again with it without having any problems of we don't have any batteries. They ate through the batteries so fast <laughs> that we get no car to play with. And then Dylan gets a little impatient, and then starts running the car like a regular, like it is, a car, and then end up breaking them. So this is one of those things that, yes, we did good. Because uh, plenty of hours of play, and we don't have to worry about it's um, losing out of battery. Game. All right, so let's go ahead now and get Julian to talk about his games. Because Julian is, uh, while Dylan is a more of a manual gamer, Julian is more of a visual effects gamer. So he got two games, Dylan. He got two games that he want to talk about. He has... Go ahead. Roger and Clank. In for PS4. Alrighty. This is Roger and Clank. And this um, game is a reanimation part for Charging. the movie. The, the movie came back out in 2016. And they, the movie, I guess, it was a success because they decided to do a game about it and I guess it, it continues from where the movie left off kind of um, and it continues into the game uh, so far I have seen that it's been pretty easy for Julian to play Julian is six years old so um, this game is uh, E10 and M10 and up and for him being six he, he has a good chance of playing with no problem um, the other game that he's going to talk about is it's Batman! Yes. Bat Batman Arkham Knight. Yep, it Arkham Knight. This one was a used game that we got over, uh, I believe it was GameStop. GameStop. Uh huh. And um, this one, although it's M4 Mature, he's done pretty good with it. And yes, he has. he's playing a mature game. Yes. Um, we kind of all play together because he in this area, it's like he can't read it. So we are there to help him. So usually my 13-year-old um, and my 15-year-old be trying to help him play this game. Um, it is a single player. Um, what else would you want to say about the game? You have to stop each and every bad guy from killing the good guys. Yeah, it's a very rough game. But so far the graphics are real, real good. Um, and I want to say it's, it's pretty... Pretty challenging, but he he probably makes it. So it's a good game. Anything else you want to talk about? It's these two games are the most 
games I ever had. <laughs> those greatest games I ever had. Okay, it, uh-huh. So what you're trying to say is that these two games are some of the best games that you have had. Yeah. Okay. All righty. So that's our little review of games and stuff that we have gotten for Christmas that we really enjoyed. And um, we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.